hope you recovered. Completely, thank you. Perhaps I can do something for you. I wouldn't ask you to do any more. Except, tell me, do you know how I came to find you? Don't you remember what happened? No, I... It's like a nightmare. I can recall the carriage overturning, and that's all. All at once, you appeared in the doorway. We were in the chapel saying a prayer. Then you fainted. Had you traveled very far? Yes, I think so, though I'm not sure. I was looking for my father. Or at least, I was attempting to look for him. My name's Mary. It would be best if you remained here. It's unpleasant traveling now. There are a great many dead on the roads. No, I must leave at once. It's urgent, and the place I'm going to is far away. Your journey would be tiring and dangerous. The countryside is swarming with thieves and murderers. A risk that I will have to take. I wish you'd think about it. Don't go now. I beg you. If the plague had not taken so many of my soldiers, I would offer you an escort to accompany you on the rest of your journey. Might I suggest that we send a message on ahead that your friends can dispatch some soldiers to escort you? You will have to excuse us. We're holding a requiem in honor of Count Humboldt. Most saddening. Were you related? My father. Oh, I'm so sorry. I shall be sad if you leave. Will you? Who will deliver the message for me? You can give it to von Kleyer. Tomorrow. He'll make sure that it gets there. Mm. 